a good day to you. I bring the good wishes of Moff Sarek, the officer entrusted with annexing this planet. He has been anticipating your arrival. Either I'm moving up in the world, or there are people he wants dead. Knowing the Moff, sir, I would guess more than a few. Good day! You have served us before, have you not? A valuable hire. I expect to care little for the niceties of politics here, so I will be brief. The Empire intends to use Alderaan's succession struggle to bring it into the fold, and I'm offering you the opportunity to play a pivotal role. Is this a job interview, then? Oh, you have the job, if you're willing. We would not be speaking otherwise. The heir to Alderaan's throne was recently assassinated, right after withdrawing from the protection of the Republic. The planet's in civil war, and for the first time in thousands of years, without the armies of the Republic to bring order. A divided world will fall quickly. Yes. We must make our move now, while the throne stands empty. We have an alliance with one of the noble houses, House Thul. The house was exiled 60 years ago after a failed bid for power, and came to us instead. Unfortunately, they have proven too weak to do what's needed. You got someone they're not killing for you? Yes. But Thal must also learn what it means to be an arm of the Empire. Jorad, one of the Thal Lords, insists on following Alderaan's rules of civilized warfare. I want you to show him warfare is far from civil. Several of Thal's vassal houses have rebelled since Thal's connection to us became public. This cannot be allowed. Take a slave collar from my man here and drag one of these rebels to our weak-willed Lord Thal. Kill the rest and leave them where they fall. They will learn that the best way to survive is to submit. These lords of Alderaan must lose their foolish pride. Those who will not bow must break. It's interesting. isn't the best time to start bonding. What is... who... Uh, Crimar? Is that Crimar Noven? That's a free nobleman of Alderaan. Unhand him. Who are you? W what, what's this about? <gasps> Sarek sent me to round up these traitors. Uh, 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 yes, Moff Sarek had suggested using tactics like... Um... All of Alderaan will be thrown into chains because of you. You two work this out. I've got some credits to claim. 
What is the Empire offering? We can match it. Alderaan has wealth. We can... You can submit to Imperial rule or find every man, woman, and child wearing that collar. Sir. A spineless toad will make a poor lord of Alderaan. Yes. It will take work to shape him. I hope you will undertake this for me. I would like to offer you a commission. Be my representative in House Thor. Aid Jorad and his men in crushing all resistance to the Empire. Obey him as if it were me, and with the same penalty for defiance. Tell him what you need, and he will ensure Thor's hold on Alderaan. Yes, sir. Sir. Penalty for defiance? I like the sound of that. I suppose the Moth expects us to take on House Organa. They're one of our oldest noble houses and loyal to the Republic. Until recently, they've been without an army, but they've got supporters all over the planet, uh, including here. You'll never find them. They've got top of the line cloaking better than anything the Empire makes. No probes will get through, no spy sats, nothing. You've got the brains of a Bantha. <laughs> House Organa denied raising an army, claiming it's just patriots defending their lands. But their attacks are too organized. We'll never find every group. We need to get inside their planet-wide communications. And that means finding a base with a physical link to slice into. Whatever. I'm on the clock. How can you destroy the culture of an entire world and call it a mere day of work? Silence! If you stand with the Organas, you betray a thousand years of loyalty. The Organa guerrillas have a base hidden in some cave or other natural camouflage. There should be a master comlink there, guarded by their best soldiers. If you insert this computer spike, it'll give us a backdoor into all their communications. Once we can hear them, there's nowhere on this world they'll be safe. House Organa will not make another move without us knowing.
After you, I insist. Impressive work. You can see we now have access to the Organa systems. They're all talking about the, uh, the ruthlessness and brutality of the recent attack. They, uh, they do train you Imperials well, don't they? I'm no Imperial, but I'll take that as a compliment. I thought you might. Now that we can monitor the Organa's communications, it should be possible to... Lord Thule, the base is under attack. Send aid quickly. Border outpost 2 under attack. I repeat, under attack. Perimeter defense is breached. We're under attack by assault droids. Repeat, a coordinated attack by probe and assault droids. Blood of the Queen. This job just keeps getting better all the time. I'm getting data feeds right now. It's a coordinated attack. All three border outposts. Hunter killers and probe droids. All I've got out there is a skeleton crew. You're the only one close enough to reach them in time. Please, save my bases and bring me the memory cores from any probes you destroy. I want to know who's behind this. Good luck. I'll bring you the heads of those droids and their master. Thank you. Now hurry!
I cannot thank you enough for your quick work. I don't know what the Organas were after, but that attack was long in the planning. I'm always a professional. Moff Sarek was wise to hire you. No one else on Alderaan acts with your swift brutality. <coughs> Who's the source of these? What were they looking for? And quickly! The programming signatures point to Lord Cedric Kilesa. Lord is my vassal. He swore loyalty to me personally when we returned from exile. Bottom line, no one's gonna serve you if it doesn't serve them. The parameters indicate the probes were to join an assault team in a... My lord, this program indicates an assault team massing in a tunnel between here and the Kalisa estate. I don't find any such tunnel on the blueprint. The siege tunnel! Blood of a queen! They're, they're coming through the siege tunnel! Those attacks were meant to draw your guards away from the palace. The wretched traitor! That tunnel connects his lands directly to our estates. No one's used it in centuries, but it, it, the tunnel opens right under this room. What are we going to do? Defeating a standing army goes for a time and a half. It is, of course, whatever. This is my family's home. Moff Sarek gave us cartons of thermite explosives. They take time to set up, but they, they pack a punch. If you take them into the siege tunnel, you could collapse it on Cedric and his army. Seal the access, so they can't threaten us again. You should have sealed it off the minute you went to war. You have taught me the importance of taking action. There's an entrance to the tunnel nearby. The storeroom is in the same area. I'll recall my troops to defend the surface, but there's no doubt the real battle will be below. Thank you. Righto. We're a great team.
do. the Imperial puppet who taught Jorad Thule to bite instead of bark. Does he lick your hand? Fetch your slippers? Real Alderanians will never bow to the likes of you. Yield, and you may keep your title and your lands. I would sooner see Alderaan blasted into space debris than given over to the Empire. You don't even have the guts to fight this yourself instead of hiding behind a cart and a thermite. If you had a shred of decency, you'd settle this by an honorable duel. You against me. You against me. You surprise me, Bounty Hunter. I thought your kind couldn't change their minds unless they're paid to. A duel of skill, then. If you win, I will give my house over to Jorah Thule to use as he will. If I win, you stand aside and let me cleanse Alderaan of this scourge and tell your Imperial handlers Alderaan lives free or dies! To arms! <laughs> I concede. You have the better skill. Perhaps it is Alderaan's fate to fall to the Empire. I will tell my people. We must find a way to live through these times. Show them that sometimes there's more strength in yielding. I will tell my army to stand down. Thank you for this mercy. The Kalejas just surrendered. My men are returning from the outpost to take them into custody. The Kalezas are acknowledging you as a man of honor. I will tell Moff Serek of your heroism immediately. I have won your place for you fairly, in a way they understand. An unnecessary luxury. 
but it did not cost us the battle this time. The Thals need not fear any further rebellion in their ranks. If the Empire is to keep you on retainer, our money would better go toward using you elsewhere. General Stunnel Thal is coordinating our efforts near House Ald. Speak to him if you'd like to take a further role in this conquest. You have saved my house's dream of ruling our world, and taught me much about what that will mean. I will not forget. We'll talk later, okay? <laughs>